Leucovorin calcium is a medication that is commonly used to address or prevent severe blood cell disorders like thrombocytopenia, neutropenia, and anemia, which are typically caused by specific drugs like folic acid antagonists such as methotrexate, trimethoprim, and pyrimethamine. It's important to take this medication as directed by your healthcare provider, and to discuss any concerns or questions you may have about the daily dosage and optimal timing for taking leucovorin calcium. You can take leucovorin calcium by mouth, with or without food, as prescribed by your doctor. This is usually taken every 6 hours or once daily, depending on your medical condition and how you respond to treatment. It's important to take this medication regularly to get the most benefit from it. Try to take it at the same time each day to help you remember. If you are unable to take this medication because of nausea or vomiting, talk to your doctor. You may need to switch to the injection form of this medication. Your doctor has prescribed leucovorin calcium because they believe the benefits outweigh the potential side effects. Most people who use this medication do not experience serious side effects. Although it's rare, a very serious allergic reaction to leucovorin calcium can occur. If you notice symptoms such as rash, itching, swelling, severe dizziness, or difficulty breathing, seek medical help immediately. It's important to note that this is not a complete list of possible side effects. If you experience any other effects, contact your doctor or pharmacist. If you're in the US, you can report side effects to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088 or at www.fda.gov slash medwatch. In Canada, you can report side effects to Health Canada at 1-866-234-2345. Before taking leucovorin, make sure to talk to your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies to it or any related medications. This medication may contain inactive ingredients that can cause allergic reactions, so it's important to discuss this with your pharmacist. Also, be sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist about your medical history, especially if you have certain types of anemia due to vitamin B12 deficiency. If you are planning to have surgery, Inform your doctor or dentist about all the medications and products you are using, including prescription drugs, non-prescription drugs, and herbal products. If you are pregnant, leucovorin should only be used if it is clearly needed. It's important to discuss the potential risks and benefits with your doctor before using this medication. If you are breastfeeding, it is uncertain whether this medication passes into breast milk, so consult your doctor before breastfeeding while using leucovorin. When taking leucovorin calcium, it's important to be aware of potential drug interactions that may affect how your medications work or increase the risk of serious side effects. It's essential to keep a list of all the products you use, including prescription and non-prescription drugs, as well as herbal products, and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. Do not start, stop, or change the dosage of any medicines without your doctor's approval. Additionally, it's important to note that leucovorin is very similar to levolucovirin, so it's crucial not to use medications containing levolucovirin while using leucovorin calcium. Always follow your doctor's guidance and recommendations when taking this medication to ensure its effectiveness and safety. If someone has taken too much leucovorin calcium and is experiencing severe symptoms like fainting or difficulty breathing, it's important to seek immediate medical help. In the U.S., you can call your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222, while residents of Canada can call a provincial poison control center. It's important not to share leucovorin calcium with others. Your doctor may also want to monitor your kidney function, complete blood count, and folic acid antagonist blood levels while you are taking this medication. Make sure to attend all of your medical and lab appointments, and consult your doctor for more details. If you happen to forget to take your leucovorin calcium dose, you can take it as soon as you remember. However, if it's almost time for your next dose, it's best to just skip the missed dose and take your next dose at the usual time. It's important not to double the dose to make up for the missed one. As for the best time to take leucovorin calcium, it's recommended to follow your doctor's instructions for the daily dosage and timing. It is important to store leucovorin calcium at room temperature and away from light and moisture. Make sure to keep it out of reach of children and pets. Do not flush this medication down the toilet or pour it into a drain, unless instructed to do so. When this product is expired or no longer needed, make sure to properly discard it. 
you can consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for guidance on how to do this. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.